Set in early 19th century England, Pride and Prejudice follows the story of 20-year-old Elizabeth Bennet, one of five daughters in the Bennet household. The story begins with a wealthy bachelor called Mr. Bingley moving into the area. The property owned by Mr. Bennet is entailed, meaning that only male heirs can inherit it. It is for this reason that Mrs. Bennet pushes for an engagement between Mr. Bingley and one of her daughters in the hope of obtaining financial security. Under the influence of Mrs. Bennet, Mr. Bingley, along with his friend Mr. Darcy, soon become acquainted with the Bennet family. Although Elizabeth is impressed by Bingley's manners, she feels considerably less cordial toward Carcy's cold demeanor. Blocked by both pride and prejudice, the two characters dance around each other throughout the novel, but as time passes, they begin to understand each other, and themselves, in the process. I give Pride and Prejudice 4 out of 5 stars. The plot largely deals with societal interactions within a small community that is meant to represent society as a whole, meaning that every conversation is important and carefully crafted by the author. The manner in which each character speaks or conducts themselves reveals who they are and what they represent, and unravels the meaning behind, unraveling the meaning behind their words was like watching a complex puzzle just fall together. I'd recommend this book to anyone interested in a different take on feminism who is willing to take the time to really appreciate it, but if you're looking for something faster paced or feminist works just aren't your thing, you may want to look elsewhere.